to towering cliffs. Great Britain's coastline contains a series of unique habitats, home to some of the world's largest seabird colonies, and patrolled by one of Britain's most fearsome coastal predators. Remarkably, well over a third of Britain's coasts are cliffs. These soaring rocks can be treacherous places. But for some seafarers, they offer sanctuary. Every spring, the cliffs on Anglesey in northwest Wales attract 10,000 guillemots. They've come to raise a family. But there isn't much room. It may seem precarious, but nesting on these narrow ledges means they're totally safe from land predators. This pair has returned from eight months out at sea. Guillemots mate for life and could be together for 30 years. Luckily, they've found a safe place to lay their single egg. Or so it seems. This wealth of life attracts one of the coast's top predators. The great black-backed gull. With wings over one and a half meters wide, three times the size of a guillemot, these are formidable hunters. Largest of all the gulls, they rule the skies. And they've come to these cliffs to steal. With a family on the way, the guillemot pair needs to be on their game. Whilst the female guards their valuable ledge, the male prepares to head out to sea. But pirates are circling, waiting for the opportunity to steal a catch. Guillemots are safe when they're on the water. It's getting back to their nests that's the problem. The gulls target birds returning with fish, forcing them to take evasive action. As a last resort, guillemots give up their precious food. The stakes are high for the gulls, too. They have their own families to feed. Despite the risks, the male guillemot heads out to sea. Getting there is no problem, but the gulls will be waiting for him when he returns. For now, he can fish in peace. His short, powerful wings are perfect for swimming. And he can dive 150 meters beneath the surface. Fishing is the easy bit. Now he's got to get back to the cliff. He stays close to the water, but the marauding gull won't let him pass, pushing him to drop his catch. This gull gives up 